All right guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. I'm starting this vlog on a bike, riding no handed all over the road like a crazy man. And currently in the rainforest, as you can see on this super creepy quiet road, got my backpack on. I'm starting this vlog on a bike. I'm riding to the closest shop. It's like a couple of k's away. And I'm pretty sure, well I'm hoping you can pay for you can pay for internet there. Because I need to go and download a song for this video so I can edit with it later. Because I realized if I film this video and then have to edit and have no song, I pretty much won't be able to edit the video. So I'm starting this vlog in the rainforest. I'm still away on holiday until the 8th of January. Today is my last day I can actually make a video at all until I get back on the 8th of January. So I'm currently running down a hill. That's how we do it out here. Uh, basically, in today's video, well, first of all, I need to go to the internet cafe. Or not the internet cafe, it's like a cafe where you can pay for internet. So basically an internet cafe. And I'm going to pay for like 20 minutes of internet just so I can download a song. Then I'm going to go back to the cabin I'm staying at, go get my scooter. And there's a car coming behind me. I'm going to go get my scooter and uh, then I'm going to go try and find some spots to ride. And I'm also going to go look for some crazy hill bombs in the rainforest. And ride down them as fast as I can with my GoPro on. My original idea for this video was to go and find street spots because there are pretty much none. Basically like, well I wasn't really going to find street spots, I was going to pretty much try and find anything that I could ride my scooter on. And just like kind of base the video off, if people lived here, you know, what would it be like to be a scooter rider? So I was going to go around and try and find things to ride on. Let me just pull up here to the side of the road. Over the past few hours, between filming the Q&A video, which I filmed earlier this morning, because this is the only day that I can actually make a video. So I filmed the Q&A video earlier today, and now I'm filming this video right now. I'm starting this video right now. I had a quick cruise around between filming the Q&A video and now, looking for anything that I could potentially ride, and literally nothing, guys. There's seriously nothing. What I did find, though, one thing I did find were super, super, super steep roads. This one road, if I follow this road all the way along, all the way along to this, like, huge intersection, there are these like insanely huge, windy, twisted hill bombs. The roads aren't super smooth and my wheels are pretty destroyed, so it's going to be super sketchy. But I'm going to get out the GoPro because I brought the GoPro down to the coast with me. I'm going to get out the GoPro and uh, put it on and bomb these insane hills in the rainforest. It's going to be super, super, super sick, super, super sketchy. I need to go down to the, uh, to the cafe, get some internet, download a song. Then I'm going to go back, get my scooter, then explore, try find some, uh, try find some big hill bombs. Switch up to the GoPro and, uh, and bomb them. It's going to be insane. So I'm going to continue my journey right now. the internet while I'm on the way back I'm nearly back where my scooter is I thought I may as well show you one of the hills that I'm planning on bombing down I don't have my GoPro with me I only have the G7X and I'm still on the bike but I'll give you a quick sneak peek of one of the hills that I'm gonna bomb down so there's one that goes down there so this is when it gets real rainforestry as you can see it's just like trees overhanging the road there's a few cars here and there but um not that many cars come by here let me stop off real quick if I go start here all the way down it doesn't look that big but it is huge and it looks dope with all the trees and there's even more trees around this area and then if i go all the way down all the way up the top of that hill up there i'm going to go all the way down this and then go all the way to the top of that hill and then bomb that whole thing all the way down up to here now let me turn around i don't want to don't want to spoil it too much so that's the hill I'm gonna go back right now, grab my scooter, put on some proper shoes, because I've just got thongs on right now, and I'm gonna go bomb all the hills on my scooter with the GoPro on. All 
All right, let me quickly explain exactly where I am. So I am a six hour drive away from home. This is where we come every year on a family holiday. And that is why I couldn't really not come because it's something I've been doing since I was like three or four years old. It means a lot to me this holiday. And um, this year I'm only here for three days and then tomorrow I'm going elsewhere to another place and I'm gonna be there for three days and I'm not gonna be able to make videos while I'm there. So this is the last day I can make a video. That's why I filmed the Q&A video earlier this morning and this video in the same day. That's why I'm filming them in the same day even though they'll be uploaded kind of like even though the upload schedule with these two videos will be kind of spread out, I'm actually filming them both in the same day. The time right now, is that going to focus up 4.31pm? I need to let this camera charge up for a bit. I need to charge up my GoPro. I'm going to have something to eat, chill out. Then I'm going to go bomb the hills. It's going to be insane. Like, I, oh my god, just hill bombs are the best because they're so adrenaline rushing. I don't even know if that's a word or a phrase, but I just made it one. It's so adrenaline rushing. It just gets your blood pumping. It just gets you so hyped. And being able to capture it on such an awesome camera like the GoPro and share it with you guys is just such an awesome experience for both you and me. And um, I'll show you my wheels right now. Uh, it's like at like a point, like just here it's at a point where my fingertip is. And then it goes down on the two sides, which is super sketchy. It means that I've power slid the crap out of both sides of the wheel. There is barely any urethane left on my back wheel. Look at that. And the bearings make a stupidly loud noise. Look at that. There's like barely any urethane. So... It's going to be super, super, super sketchy to be bombing these hills, but I'm going to do it. As I said, need to let this camera charge up for a bit. Let my GoPro charge up. The beast. Next stop, massive jungle rainforest hill bombs. It's going to be sick. Finally charged up all my cameras, emptied out my SD cards, kicked back for a little bit. It is now 6 p.m. By the way, look where I am. This pond is filthy. Look at these ducks right here. Yo, what's up? You guys are in the vlog, guys. Anything to say? Okay, nothing. Okay, so I took like a little detour to the uh, to the road that I have to get onto, and I've taken this weird like kind of jungle pathway up to the up to the roads, which is right here. I've got the GoPro on. Haven't got it strapped up yet. But I got it there. By the way, that blue thing is a lens cap for anyone wondering. I've been coming to this place every single year for... Since I was like three or four years old, as I said. Every single time I've come here, I'm like, Oh, I wish I brought my scooter. I don't know how many hills I'm going to go down. Probably like three or four. Anyway, I had to catch my breath back and keep walking. Just down there, that's my brother. He's going to take a photo of me going down a hill. I'm going to set up the camera. My brother's got a tripod. I'm going to set up this camera. I coincidentally found him on the hill. He was taking photos himself. That's the hill that we just walked down and the big hill that I was planning on bombing, it like goes like around a corner. It's all windy and turny and stuff. So that one is going to be like super sketchy to go down. I'll do that one after. I'm going to warm up on this one just there. Brother's going to get a photo. If you want to see that photo, just go check my Instagram at jacked out to see the final product of the DSLR photo. But yeah, I'm going to bomb down that one first. I'm going to set up this camera that I'm filming on right now on the tripod, which is just here lying in the middle of the road. So I'm going to set this up about there and going to switch up to the GoPro right now. So hopefully the footage turns out alright. Alright. I'm ready. Alright, so I tried out that different angle on the GoPro with the GoPro facing up so I could like bend over and like have my head forward and it didn't turn out as good as like all my other GoPro angles so I'm just going to stick to um, stick to the usual GoPro angle. I'm currently vlogging with a massive tripod right now. And um, so yeah, now I'm going to go to the big windy hill 
Um, the long, like, like this long lens angle, the G7X is only going to be able to capture like me just coming down like the bottom of the hill, but the GoPro will get the whole entire thing. This road is like super windy, like that one, I don't know, I picked up a bit of speed, wasn't super fast, it was a little bit bumpy as well, but uh, this one should be like insane. It's, it's windy and everything, look at it. So, um, yeah, this camera will be set up at the bottom as I'm like coming around the bend, as I'm coming around the last hill. I don't know what's above, so... I guess I'll have to find out when I'm up there, but uh, yeah, the G7X is going to be left down the bottom. Around this corner, all the way down here. I'm going to start right here, follow that car all the way around, and do the big windy hill bomb. Alright, I'm going to strap it up to the chest. Oh my god, that was the craziest hill bomb I've ever done in my life. My back, oh my, oh no, look at my back wheel. It's starting to melt. Oh my god, a massive chunk taken out of my back wheel. Oh my god. Woo. Let me just switch up to the G7X right now so I can show you exactly what happened to my back wheel in detail. Okay, this part of the road is smooth and that's the bumpy part. You can kind of see like the lighter part is the smoother part, the darker part is the much rougher stuff. And didn't really think it through. I did a massive power slide on the rougher stuff and look what happened to my wheel. And look at that. Oh my god. Look at the side of my wheel. Completely destroyed. Oh my god. That's pretty... that sucks. That absolutely sucks. But that's not going to stop me from uh, continuing on with, with the video. And guys, did that hill bomb. Did that hill bomb. Pretty small, medium. Next is the big hill bomb, guys. It's not over yet. Alright, so my little brother's gone and he took the tripod with him, so no more tripod footage, but I'm gonna walk all the way to the top of the hill that I just bombed. Here's the corner coming right up. Oh my god, insane, and with that like ray of sunlight going across the road, that probably looked awesome. My little brother got some awesome photos as well. Super sketchy walking along these roads, there is no footpath. I need to go do these exploration type videos so much more often. This is so fun. I'm actually gonna switch to the other side of the road, because there's more bush I can walk on. I took my run up from about here, Ran, 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 and then I'll try to zoom in a little bit. I went all the way around that corner. As I showed you, my wheels on the sides are completely like demolished. Even before I did it, they were still pretty bad. So I was like slipping out and stuff. That guy that just drove past in that ute is the ranger of this whole like national park area. I've seen him before. <laughs> I thought I was getting kicked out for a second. Kicked out in the rainforest for doing hill bombs. Oh my god. Anyway, instead I'm gonna go all the way up there, all the way to the top of that hill. So where that pole is right now, where you can see my fingertip, I'm gonna start there. Zoom all the way around. I'm gonna be going super high speed by the time I'm about here. Then this part is still completely sloped. Full speed all the way around that turn. My G7X is about to die as well. Perfect opportunity to switch up to the GoPro. Okay. Halfway through this hill bomb, I might have to put my foot down for like a couple of seconds just to slow down before I go through that next big curve because my wheels could slip out any second and I really do not want to get hurt. I haven't even got a helmet on. This is actually pretty stupid, but I said I'd do it. Let's pick up the pace a little bit. Hopefully no cars go past me when I'm going around the curve. Whew. I don't have a phone with me or anything. And even if I did, there's no reception around here. Drop a thumbs up right now, guys. Look where I am. Like seriously, look where I am. I'm in the jungle. Alright guys, here goes nothing. Here goes nothing at all. Okay. Oh my god. I'm actually scared. Alright, let's do it. Ooh. Oh my god. Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Still going! 
my god. Somehow my G7X is still working, even though it was about to die before. That was insane. I'm probably going to wrap the video up right here in the jungle, guys. I'm going to go home, run into the ocean, go swim. You wanted to see the part I've been going on about for a while now. Finally got it done. Look at the bottom of my deck. Because these roads have got stones all over them, especially the last hill bomb I just did. Look at the scratches from the rocks spitting up on my deck. That is, I've never, ever, ever, ever seen that before. So my deck is all scratched up on the bottom. Took a massive, well a decent, a pretty deep chunk out of my wheel. My scooter's a bit of a wreck right now. So I'm gonna wrap up this video guys. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. This has been one of my most insane videos so far. I'm so glad I had time and I found a bit of a section out of my day to actually go out and make a video for you guys despite being on holiday. I'm not sure what date this video will be uploaded either on the uh, either on the 5th or 6th of January, I think and then no videos up until I get home on the 8th of January All the cars are looking at me weird. They've never seen a vlogger in the wild Anyway guys, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog before my camera actually dies I'm gonna stop right here as soon as I get back on the 8th of January. I'll resume to my usual upload schedule I'm gonna try bring out videos daily uh, for the week I get back. Please subscribe if you're new to the channel, drop a like below if you enjoyed, and leave a positive comment and give me some video ideas uh, for when I'm back home in Sydney. So uh, yeah, today has been absolutely insane. Thank you so much for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace out.